Today, we start a path that will change the way we work and live, giving us the tools we need to be successful and happy. In this fast-paced world, it's important to find a balance between our work goals and the things that make us happy as people. So, let's jump right in and find out how to have a good mix between work and life. To really figure out how to balance work and life, we need to understand how millennials think. As a generation that is driven by a sense of purpose, we look for jobs that match our beliefs and give us personal satisfaction. We want to be successful, not just in terms of money, but also in terms of personal growth and making a difference in the world. The key to a successful and happy life is to recognize our unique skills and use them to our advantage. Millennials have grown up during a time when technology and society have changed quickly. We've seen how powerful new ideas can be and really want to make a difference. We want our work to give us flexibility, freedom, and a sense of meaning. It's important to make sure that our careers match up with our passions and ideals so that we can be ourselves at work. It's easy to forget about self-care when we're trying to get ahead. But we have to realize that taking care of ourselves is not a luxury, it's a must. Self-care means taking care of our mental, physical, and social health. This means giving our bodies the care they need by making exercise, eating well, and getting enough sleep a top priority. It also means doing things like meditation, or writing in a book that help you keep your mind calm and on task. Seeking therapy or counseling can help you deal with the problems you face in life. When we put ourselves first, we get our energy back, become more productive, and feel happier overall. Remember that taking care of ourselves is not selfish, it's an important investment in our success and happiness in the long run. The key to both personal and business success is having a growth mindset. It's about recognizing the power of being able to keep learning, stay strong, and change. As millennials we need to know that loss is not a setback, but a step on the way to success. We can get past problems and hit new heights if we look at failure as a chance to learn and grow. To develop a growth attitude, we can look for new challenges, set lofty goals, and hang out with people who support us and share our values. Whether it's through books, podcasts, or online classes, a love of learning keeps our minds open and flexible in the face of change. In the modern age we live in now, work and personal life often mix. It's important to move through this world with care and set healthy limits to keep a sense of balance. Here are some ways to make the most of technology without getting burned out or overwhelmed by it. First, make it clear when you are working and when you are not. Set times to work and times to relax, and let your co-workers and loved ones know about these times. We can recharge and be fully present in our daily lives when we spend time away from technology. Second, manage internet distractions. We can stay organized and work well by limiting alerts, setting up focused work times, and using tools for productivity. By taking charge of our digital world, we can keep our attention on what we're doing and reduce distractions. Last, we should use technology to our benefit. Use productivity apps, project management tools, and communication platforms to streamline processes, improve collaboration, and make more time for the things that really matter. When used with care, technology can be a powerful friend. Our relationships with other people have a huge effect on how we balance work and life. Millennials want real connections and to feel like they belong. By making and keeping important personal and professional ties, we can improve our well-being and build a support system that lifts us up. Networking isn't just about exchanging business cards, it's about making real connections based on shared hobbies and values. 
Look for chances to be a mentor both inside your organization and through professional networks. A mentor can help you with your job by giving you advice, support, and important information. Collaboration is another important part of making relationships that matter. By working with other people, we can use their knowledge and skills, spark their imagination, and make a bigger difference. Collaboration builds a sense of community and success for everyone, which makes us happier as a whole. Boundaries and routines are important for keeping work and life in balance. They help us set clear boundaries between our work and personal lives, making sure that both get the care they need. Let's talk about ways to set up healthy limits and important rituals. When it comes to setting limits, be clear about what you need and what you expect from your coworkers, friends, and family. Respectfully stand up for your right to time and space for yourself, and encourage others to do the same. By making and sticking to rules, we create a healthy mix between work and life that is good for everyone. Rituals are planned actions that bring joy, rest, and meaning to our lives. They can be as easy as going for a walk in the woods, practicing gratitude every day, or spending quality time with people you care about. Rituals help us slow down, enjoy the present, and find happiness in both our personal and work lives. As we go through life, our goals and priorities change. To keep work and life in order, it's important to look at them and change them every so often. Here are some ways to set goals that can be reached, manage our expectations, and change our priorities as things change. First, be clear about your beliefs and your overall life goals. What's important to you? What are your short-term and long-term goals? If you know where you want to go, you can set goals that match your values and bring you closer to your vision. Break your goals down into smaller steps that you can do. This method lets you enjoy your progress and stay motivated as you go. Adopt a flexible and adaptable attitude, and change your goals and interests when you need to. Remember that life is always changing, and it's okay to go in a different direction if it fits your needs and goals better. Check in on your work and responsibilities often. Do you have too much on your plate? Are there chores or projects that could be given to someone else or done away with? Learn to say no to things that don't really matter. This will give you the time and energy to focus on what does. Mastering work-life balance as a millennial requires understanding our unique mindset. Putting self-care first. Cultivating a growth mindset. Navigating the digital landscape mindfully. Building meaningful relationships. Setting boundaries. Establishing rituals. And reevaluating our goals and priorities. Don't forget that finding a good mix between work and life is an ongoing process that takes planning and self awareness. By using these tips and figuring out what works best for you, you can give yourself the tools you need to be successful and happy in all parts of your life. Millennials, know that you can find a good balance between work and life. Accept the difficulties, be happy about the wins, and never lose sight of your own health. Thank you for coming on this journey with me. I invite you to share your thoughts, experiences and insights about your mastering work-life journey to help and learn from each other. Together, we can make our lives successful, happy and full of meaning. Until next time, stay strong and keep trying to find that right balance.